What's up guys? Welcome to Invest with a Purpose. Today's video is going to be about a penny stock that I found that has gone up over 300% in the last about week and a half and I think has huge upside potential for the future. It's something that I'm looking at right now as a long-term investment but is, that is so cheap and kind of at a startup situation that could really turn out to be something huge. Before we hop into the video, I want to remind you guys that I post multiple videos per week that help you guys choose what stocks to invest in right now based off of what I'm doing and just my opinions. If you guys enjoy simple, quick, and to the point kind of content, consider taking a second to subscribe. It really goes a long way when supporting me and hopefully you guys can stay on track and don't miss anything about what stocks are going to be coming up very soon. Now that's out of the way, let's get to what you guys came here for. The stock that I'm going to be talking about today is web safety. Let's get into the question that you might be asking now. What is web safety and who are they? Web Safety is a software company that has created mobile apps for Android and iOS mobile operating systems. The Web Safety app allows parents to monitor questionable and potentially harmful content or a direct predatory exchange that occurs on their children's mobile device. Now, you might be asking, why is this even important? There's multiple apps that do that, and you would be right. There are lots of apps that allow parents to do just that. But it's not exactly what this company is about or the description about the company. It's what the company is trying to acquire and is signed a contract to acquire. On December 21st, Web Safety signed a contract to acquire a company called Vertidex, or I don't really know how to say it. It's like Veridex or something like that. It'll be up on the screen right now. Veridex is a company that manufactures and sells disinfecting booths. And these disinfecting booths are FDA approved, so it's not harmful for humans or food or you know any, anything like that. It's super duper clean and good. I haven't seen them around the US at all. Let me know in the comments if you guys have ever seen this, but I hear that they're in a lot of different companies and I've seen them online. I'll show up a little slideshow of kind of what they are, what they look like. If you don't know what they are, they're these booths that you walk through, kind of like when you go to the airport and you can walk through TSA and you have the metal detector things that you walk through. They're kind of like that, but instead of checking you for dangerous things on your body or whatever, they disinfect you. They disinfect your surfaces like your clothes and your arms and your skin and stuff like that so that you can be kind of fully sanitized before walking into a place. And with that information, I'm sure you can see why this is a big move for web safety. It's not necessarily really good for their company or their niche or whatever that they're in, but since they're a software company, I'm sure they could come up with some really cool software to go along with these distributed uh, disinfecting booths or whatever. But also, being that they're disinfecting booths in a time right now where we're going through a pandemic, this could help. Even though, you know, COVID is more of an airborne thing, there's still touch, but this would kind of help eliminate the touch factor. And also, if you put these two together with vaccines and these disinfected booths, we can really start to lighten the curve of COVID. On top of that, I believe that moving forward past this pandemic, past COVID and everything, that we're gonna be a lot safer of a country when it comes to germs and infection. So I think as a preventative care, we could see these implemented in airports, stadiums, malls, and stuff like that, as advertised on Veridex's website. Let's cover some of the risk and kind of downside and negatives or not so great things, not necessarily in the company, but in the disinfecting booths themselves. As I said before, these are being implemented in other countries around the world, and they haven't proven to be super successful when trying to stop the spread of COVID. And some of them have even caused harm to people and not been safe for them. But what kind of negates these risks is, well, let's cover the harming humans thing. These Veridex disinfecting booths are FDA approved and do not harm people. Can't harm food, can't harm people, you can consume it, it doesn't hurt you. As far as they're not slowing the spread of COVID in other countries, here we're gonna be implementing it with not only masks, but vaccines. So masks, vaccines, and disinfectant booths, I think could be really, really good. Masks to help stop the airborne effect, the disinfectant booths to stop the spread with touch, and the vaccines to attack the virus at its core. With this stock being so cheap, I see very minimal risk with very high reward. The more we see these disinfecting booths implemented in our society with major events in major areas, like I said, with malls, sporting events, different stuff like that where there's a lot of people, we could see web safety skyrocket. And this is just off the news of it signing a contract. Once this comes to fruition in about March, and if it comes to fruition in March because they want to get it done in the first quarter, the price of this stock could skyrocket. 
it's gone up, like I said, over 300% in the last like week and a half. So once this is actually confirmed and not just a contract, this is actually acquired by web safety, this is gonna be huge. But I want you guys to keep in mind that penny stocks can be very, very volatile and you need to be careful. Make sure you have your risk management fully thought out and know your enter and exit points. This is a huge pump from this catalyst, but that doesn't mean that it's gonna stay up or keep pushing up right now. I'm expecting it to pull back some, and when it does, I'm all in on this. I think this is a really good opportunity to get in with a company before they push up in March with their confirmed contract. I don't want you guys to buy in right now and get caught up in a pump and dump situation. If you wanna buy in right now and put in a couple hundred dollars or maybe a thousand dollars or a couple thousand dollars, whatever you wanna do to get in on it while it's hot right now and see if it potentially rides up and you just ride the entire wave, go ahead and do that. Do whatever your guys' hearts desires. I am not a financial advisor and these are just my opinions. Well, that's it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed the content, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with a friend so that they can know about the next big stock. Anyways, I hope you guys have or had a great day and don't forget to invest every single second of every day with a purpose. Peace.